fuck this shit. I was a goner there for a second. Could you drop me at the nearest repair shop? That's a bad place to break down. Yeah, it started spluttering at the crossing. Then the engine just cut out. Damn car, foreign trash. I've told my wife a hundred times. But she's like, oh no, Phil, you can't say that. Not anymore. She'll soon change her tune when she finds out I nearly died. All this fancy eco crap they put in cars now. We never asked for it. We never signed that treaty. A mile less to the gallon, and maybe I wouldn't have ended up on top of the train tracks. I'm at a loss for words. Could have fooled me. Makes a nice change, though, to get towed for a good reason. Normally, I'd be cussing you out, you know, asking you how you sleep at night. I'm sure you would, man. You been in the business long? Uh, I ain't exactly in the business. Just helping out a friend, dawg. Okay, thanks again. That could have been much worse. If it ain't the finest man in South L.S. You can tell J.B. I did his work for him again. I will, boo. Soon as he wakes up. Sorry, fool. 